am back with another planning with me in my mini fitness happy planner. Uh, it's been a wonderful week. I've had some weight loss. We've eaten some really good food and yeah, it's been a great week. I do want to put a disclaimer in here and I'll probably start doing that. I am using these plan with me's for the fitness mini fitness planner to update on my health journey. And that will include a lot about my Facebook page and my Facebook group, Living Whole Food Plant-Based. Um, if you're not interested in hearing what I have to talk about, then this is probably not going to be a great video for you. If you're just here for a plan with me for Etsy stickers and stuff like that, that's not what I do. Um, so if you are still here and you want to keep watching, go get into the plan with me. Uh, I had a weight loss. I lost a pound this week. It's starting to slow down. I'm headed for my next stall. One of the things I learned very quickly about eating whole food plant-based was the fact that you lose and you stop and you lose and you stop and you lose and you stop. It, it doesn't, you don't stop like and nothing moves. It's just not, you'll have great amounts of weight loss and then smaller amounts. And I think it's just your body flushing out all the bad stuff and it's bringing in all the good food and energy. And um, I've been asked a million times, if you weren't losing weight, would you still do this? I will do this till the day I die, no matter if I never lose another pound, period. Do I think I'm not gonna lose another pound? No, I think I'm gonna reach my goal this year. In fact, I'm incredibly confident that I will. But I still, I love living this way. We love eating this way and I will do this forever. <laughs> so I get to put another sticker on my little uh, countdown here because that makes it a 12 pound loss so far. Yay! I started December 1st. I don't know, my second challenge, I, I've lost 60 pounds so far. Well, actually, my bad. <laughs> 61. 61 pounds so far, but um, I have, I, I lost the first 52. That was my challenge, my first challenge to myself, and my second challenge to myself is 30 in 30 weeks. So I am down 12 pounds of that 30 uh, pounds. I'm ahead by 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 4 pounds. So I've been really happy about how it's going. And so um, I get to update my stickers. All right, so let's jump to the monthly thing here. I get to update another date in here. And I didn't put the guy's weights in here yet, but they all lost weight. Well, Joshua, he maintains, but my husband also lost some more weight. And I won't put his his stuff in here, but I am down another pound so I get to put that in there woohoo we are this Saturday 11 months whole food plant-based we will have done it for 11 months it's our anniversary I cannot believe that we've lost a hundred and sixty pounds between the three of us my son lost 10 my husband and I lost the rest of it in just about 11 months it, it's crazy how fast this has gone it can happen for anybody it's really simple we eat a lot of food uh, a lot of new people have been joining the Facebook group and they're just amazed at how much food we eat and how much variety there is. And they thought they were, you know, hey, we're, we're you're going whole food plant-based, you just eat salads, right? Oh, hell no. <laughs> I'm not a huge salad either. So, um, but anyways, we're going to have, we're going to be 11 months um, whole food plant-based and I have a cookie recipe I am going to make um, to celebrate that. And I don't have the recipe here, but it'll be on the Facebook page in the Facebook group if you want to share it. Uh, I did have a question about uh, the recipes and stuff that I talk about. You do not have to join the Facebook group to get the recipes that we eat, that we cook and we use. Um, I have a Facebook page that's also Living Whole Food Plant Based. It's all linked down below. And I post all of our links, menu plans, the whole works goes on the public Facebook page. So no, you don't have to like it, you don't have to follow it, and you don't have to subscribe to anything. You can just pop over there and check the, the recipes that you wanna look into. All right, so that gets my monthly calendar uh, up and up to date, Blah. up, 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 and away. Um, here, I do not plan my meals out ahead of time. I use this to make sure I eat enough because one of the main things about eating whole food plant-based is you do need to eat, 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 eat. Because if you don't, 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 you're tired, you get headaches. It's called hunger. <laughs> you get to learn what hunger means. I know. But um, so I just make sure that I eat because I have a really, really, really bad habit about skipping meals. And so um, I'll update real quick. This morning I had a sweet potato, 
for breakfast and I'm munching on my lunch of a ponzo noodle salad. You guys have to try that recipe whether you're whole food plant based or not. It is to die for. Pon I can't spell and, and talk. Ponzu noodle salad. It's to die for. It's so simple. It take it, the longest part of it is is rehydrating your noodles. So um, all right. So we're caught up pretty much on there, and we are working on uh, January twenty third through Jan uh, January twenty ninth. And don't give up. I don't plan on it because there's nothing to give up on. This is so easy. Oh look, I'm almost done with January. Ooh, my first month. And as you know, disclaimer on the lights, I use natural lighting, it's winter, it comes and it goes. So enjoy the, the rainbow of color. All right, so I, I have these washi tapes. They inspired me. So I, I was just gonna decorate with the washi tapes and then I got carried away and, and I ended up with a full set of stickers for it. I will tell you that I have a link down below that has um, all of these stickers in them and it, it is the basically it's the template for this it's for a silhouette file um, it's free it's on my website which is mousepotatodesigns.com but the link is down below directly to the downloads there is a password required to get into those because I don't want them direct linked so um, it's really easy just just read down below you can't miss it it says freebies and there's a link <laughs> and the password uh, if you have questions or concerns or comments, leave me a message here or you can also leave a message on the page that you're going to go to or just hit me up somewhere and, and I will answer whatever I can. I'm not great at making these files, so don't expect you know professional things, but I did the best that I could. It's what I use, so anyways, I found this smiley face background at um, a website, oh, what's it called? Photo, hold that thought. Oh, free vectors, photos, and downloads, freepick.com, and I will also link that down below. Um, they have images that you can use for personal use only, um, and this is the, the, the place I go to for most of my graphics. Um, I don't buy them. I, I'm going to use them once. Why would I buy them? Um, so, anyways, let's get to decorating. This is going to be a full spread. And you can kind of see how the stickers go down. If you've watched my plan with me before, you already know how the stickers are going to go down. Oh, let's get rid of that. Okay, so let's start here with this one. And what they do is it's a full sticker that covers all the way across. See? Smile. Yep, smile. Um, while I'm doing this, I did want to answer a couple of questions that I was asked. Uh, where to start with whole food plant-based? <laughs> it's really simple, actually, but um, most people get kind of confused or they're scared. It, it is not vegan. It, it, if you're afraid that you, all of a sudden you have to give up your shoes, your belts, and your shampoo, you don't have to do that. <laughs> if you want to, that's great. It's great for the animals and it's great for the planet, but I, I'm not a vegan. I don't claim to be a vegan. I have nothing against veganism. But I, I'm just not that hardcore. <laughs> I did it for my health with a side effect of saving the planet. Works for me. But what I would recommend doing is that you pop over to my Facebook page, Living Whole Food Plant Based. If you type it in just like that or use the link down below, it will take you to my Facebook page. On that Facebook page, if you click the notes, that's in the left hand column, it will take you to the file section with all the notes on it. And right in that page is a whole, or right in that section is a whole page on how to get started. And I really recommend that you check that out. It It's how we got started, so that's why I like to share it because I want people to kind of see how we did it and how it worked for us so you could do it that way too. The nice part about it is this whole food plant base is very customizable. There are no plans to buy, there are no books to buy, there are no videos to buy, there are no discs to buy, there's no programs to sign up for. Yes, you can buy all that stuff. There is things out there on the market available for them, but you don't have to. This is totally a free thing. It's about getting your health back and 
Oop, I totally screwed that one up. Nope, here we go. I did not. I just can't see my own stuff. Anyways, it's a free, it's free. It should be free. Everything that I offer is free. If you pay for it, I don't recommend it. Mostly because I just don't think you should have to be free or it, you should have to pay to have, um, to get your health back. I don't know where my... Okay, where did it go? I don't know where my white out went. Okay, well, okay, it's in front of my face. Just stop. Okay, so I always block this top part out, but I recommend going over to my Facebook page. There is a where to start thing. If you get over there and you can't find it, just hit the message button and it's me and I will help you find it. Um, but that gives you some videos to watch and some information and there's some great movies to watch. I'm gonna put, I got this little smiley to go here. Um, I don't put anything at the top because I write my weights in at the top, if that's why you're wondering why I didn't go all the way up with the, the date dot things. Um, but that's where I recommend you start. Forks over knives. If you don't even wanna go to my stuff, don't. I don't care, that's fine with me. Go watch the movie Forks Over Knives. Go watch the movie, then go watch the movie Hungry for Change or um, Food Choices. But I recommend Forks Over Knives. It's, it's the one that convinced my meat eating, never gonna give up a steak husband that he had to do it like that. <laughs> By the end of that movie, we were all switched. <laughs> So, um, okay, so I got the first page and stickers down. Um, this is just a personal thing that I track, so I won't explain that, but I do tra track my steps at one o'clock and at the total for the day. Eventually, I will probably add something else there, but for right now, that's all that I have. I would like to say that this bottom part here, um, I have a separate file on my face or my website that's free file that if you just want the bottom part, there's also a file for that. And again, it's free. All the information is down below. Um, but yeah, okay, so that's page one. So this is before and after. That's what it looks like so far. So let's set this aside for now and work on this other one. And then this is another ginormous sticker, but it goes on really easy. If you line up the, the one, whoops, don't set it down till you're ready. If you line up the, the one side, it usually goes down pretty, pretty straight. Don't be so picky, it's a planner, it's just for fun. Okay, so there's that. Um, so anyways, Forks Over Dice is where we started and where I recommend you start. Um, no matter what your reason is for it, losing weight, do you have heart disease, are you on heart medicine? My husband got off of all of his heart and cholesterol medicine, he's no longer pre-diabetic, so if you have diabetes, do you have inflammation, are you arthritis? Um, all of that kind of stuff. You would be amazed of what this will, will help treat, and not only treat it, it'll cure you from it. And I know it sounds like this infomercial thing, but it, it really is very amazing on what it will do for you, and it's very quick. I mean, we were off of all of our medications within a month, a month. We were told when my husband started taking his statins and stuff that he would never, ever, ever be off of his statins. Never. It didn't matter if he lose weight. It didn't matter if he got healthy. They, they may be able to tone down the amount, but he would never, ever get off of them. 30 days, he was off of two blood pressure medicines and one cholesterol medicine. Yeah. Guess never is 30 days. Um, so if you think that it won't work for you, I recommend looking into it. And that is where we started. Uh, Forks over knives. And again, I have a page on my Facebook page or my Facebook group if you have more questions um, and that's where you can find all that. Sophie are you going to play in the box while I'm on video? Is that how we're working here? Shoot. Get out of there. She has to kill the plastic. You know the plastic bubbles that come in the packaging? She has to kill it. She can't handle them poofed up. Okay so let's get the rest of these stickers down here. I have one more over here. And this is just a flag. You can change it to anything you want. Mine says week nine because that's the week that I'm going into. But 
So that's what the, the full, when the stickers are all the way down, that's what they look like. Um, in the file, you can change out the graphics, which are the background, and, and if you have questions, let me know. I'm going to try to do a video on it to show you how I did it, or not how I made it, but how to work with them, but I haven't got that done yet. All right, I do want to put um, something down the side here, and so where did my, here it is. Um, I was originally going to use that one, but I'm kind of thinking this one. I don't know. Let's see what it... This is that plastic Dollar Tree tape. No, I don't really like that. So let's... I got this one too, and it adds a bit more color. Oh, I like that one. That's a little more fun. And card. I think I'm going to do it at an angle. Make it all fancy. What do you think? Okay, and then there's that. And I don't think I'm going to put any side things on there. The other question I get the most is, does it need some over here? No. The other question I get the most is, what was the hardest part about growing whole food plant-based? Uh, to be honest, learning that I didn't hate cooking. I always thought that I hated cooking. I hate cooking. Oh my God, I hate cooking. And what I realized was is that I just hated what I was cooking. And it's so exciting now, and there's so much food out there to eat. And we have, we have, in August, I started putting together a recipe book. I just wanted to collect some of our favorites. I am 22. I'll be posting the 23rd week today uh, on the Facebook group, which also will go up on Saturday on the Facebook page. The 23 weeks of seven days of different recipes every week. And it's unbelievable how much food there is out there to eat. It's all different. It tastes different. There's so many spices and vegetables and all different kinds of food. Grains I had never heard of. Farro and quinoa and millet and oh my goodness. It's just the, the selection is unreal. And when I decided to have an attitude adjustment about the cooking, I decided that instead of looking at it as food daunting, I wanted to look at it as a food adventure. I wonder if... Ooh, that's bright. Well, that helps a little bit. What do you think? <gasps> I don't know. Anyways, I wanted to look at it as a food adventure. So I taught myself to like to cook again. And um, now I can't imagine not cooking our meals. It, you can, luckily you can make huge pots of stuff and have lots of leftovers so you don't have to cook every day. And it's really easy, but it's been really fun. And there's just a tremendous amount of food out there. So I would have to say that the hardest part was not giving up coffee and not giving up animal products, but it was learning to adjust to having to prepare my own food again. Um, my mother was, she, didn't, she cooked for us, but I don't remember us cooking a lot of different meals. My grandmother cooked a lot of food, um, but we, I wasn't raised to cook. Um, and so it was a huge learning curve for me to learn how to cook food. And then we don't, you throw on top of it no oil, and so you had to learn how to cook with no oil, which is very easy, by the way. Don't let it scare you. <laughs> but I would say that was the hardest part, is learning to cook. And, and the, the, once I realized that I could do it, it was fun. And you just kind of look forward to it after a while. But I wanted to share what I have for recipes coming. I have these little smileys from Target, and you know them. They suck. These page notes suck. <laughs> Big time. But anyways, um, there's no particular order, but this week we are having Mexican street corn chowder. We are having butternut squash and rose, uh, ricotta pizza. It is not dairy. It is made with cashew nuts. Um, we are having Indian quinoa and chickpea curry. We are having potato with beans and kale soup, gumbo, and all of these recipes will be up on my Facebook page and my Facebook group. Uh, creamy Italian quinoa soup and ginger lemongrass Thai soup with crispy tofu. And no, if you don't like tofu, you don't have to eat tofu. Although I'm betting you don't like how you've had tofu. Anyways, 
that is my spread for the the week let me find my my binder thingy here so we can see what it looks like in the book because that's all professional like right I love the smiley faces this is how I feel about my life right now I just wanted to I don't know it just made me happy the quote at the bottom says smile see miracles in life every day I hope you guys smile today. I hope that your life is giving you reasons to smile. No matter what journey you pick, no matter what you want to do in your life and how you want to get there, I hope that you grasp it and run with it. If you have more questions about what I'm doing with my life and my family's lifestyle, please leave them down below. If you have questions you'd like me to answer in the next video, leave those down below and I hope to see you in the next video. Have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. Smile. Bye guys. Thank you.